So here before I go on my bike ride is my uh, specialised energy drink. This is what I make myself. I've always done this. And that's uh, oh, it's a little bit of diluted pop. So squash. No added sugar. No, that amount of like. Fill it up with water. You can use tap water for this, like. Right, that's filled up. And then, all the secret ingredients, right? Pinch of salt for your electrolytes. And then some of your runny honey. Good glug of that, sweeten it up. Nice big dose of energy out. And then you put the lid on. Make sure it's all make sure it's all sealed in. Give it a good shake. And then have a taste. You can add add or drink them out, put some more water in, or put some more honey in. Don't think you need much salt. Oh no. That's actually spot on. So there you go. A cheap and easy energy drink. And when you're drinking that on the trail, it does give you a little bit of a boost. I've always used that. Ever since I've been young and psych when I was cycling, an old man gave us that recipe. And it used to get us up the hills. Yep, back out. Sunday, come for a bike ride just to try out the the new point of view. So we'll see how this goes. We're just trying this out. Setting off along the cycle path. And I go um, into the trees. Do a little bit of off the road. It's the road of death again. But literally, I'm just trying this out because I'm gonna, gonna ride a few trails like. Once I get me, um, what do you call it? Nerve back. Now we're just on the easy bit. Ooh. Oh, so many cars around. Here we go then. The ride of death. Ellie straight off. Tree of terror. Ugh. Oh, that would have been a nasty, nasty accident if I'd hit that tree when we back. <laughs> oh, the woods. Good. So there you go, avoid the mud on the right. Problem with mud. Ooh, as you can see, I'm no trail rider, you know, you've got to get back into it somehow, you've got to start somewhere. Kill us. Just 
stage one, the rest of it boring. This bit's a bit. A lot of roots, I suppose. In the middle of a forest, you'd expect roots. All right. Seems to be about 90, that's block. Fire. tree root I was almost killed here's a problem coming up side I need a full suspension bike if I'm going to be doing jumps this is a hard tail I'll probably end up snapping it <laughs> with my weight but for now Oh, the trails. Cheers. Say so that's what you do. Sensible people. Here's the crossroads. Just have a little uh, down here. Through the puddles of depth. one puddle and maybe this one which is really deep oh and this one oh yeah that went right up my leg oh, I couldn't avoid it right Last bit was uh, uneventful but wet. We went through another big puddle. Not to worry. Um, I'm in the trees. I don't know if anybody remembers the video I did walking around Blythe where I said I wanted to go and visit the hill. This is the hill. This is the bottom of it. The trees at the bottom. That looks like 
I could be wrong. Ooh, it is. Wild garlic. It's coming. It's not quite ready yet. Always comes a little bit later up here. Don't know if you've watched Hazy's video. He's got loads where he lives, Yorkshire. Anyway, I'm gonna have a look up here. And see what's at the top. I'm just pushing the bike at the moment, like it's too rough. So this is pretty much the top. There's been loads of evidence of campers. I mean, there's nails in trees with bits of tarp tied to it. Look. God, you're gonna dig it, dig it right. There's bags of rubbish over there. There's a, a den down there, the blue tarpaulin. I'm not gonna go and do it like. But this is the top of that hill I've finally got here. Wind. If you come and there's nobody here, this will be a good little spot. There's plenty of trees. There's loads of bits of wood lying about for a little fire. Be careful, clear it up. Unlike half the people around here, like, they haven't cleared the fire pits. But we're not like them, are we? Mm. So, I'm going to head back down now, see if I can find another track. Hopefully find a path out. Pedaling through trees. I look loads of dead wood like it's dry. Use it. Oh, these are dodgy these. They can bottom out here. Ew. And there's more trees of certain death. Oh, I'll never get under there. <laughs> Christ. One more. Oof. Just bedding these bricks in. It took a long time to bed in. They're so noisy. I'm not skilled enough to fly around here. for suspension. That's it. Nice little track. Unexpected. See how this brings out. I have a feeling I know where. Yeah. This is the um this is the road where I saw them land rovers. So I think I go along over here to the right that'll bring us out uh, to New Hartley I think we'll probably end up on the road of death for like 100 yards maybe but I'll miss all the road out if I go to New Hartley and this road to the right takes you there where I went over the bridge well across the railway line ooh that's straight out in here oh, bare left Try to grip big pothole. Oh. oh, that way is the railway line. This way to New Hartley. I really did come out on the road of death. I've come through New Hartley, but on the road of death for like 500 yards. This is the um, mausoleum over there, can't see. This is the track of much speed. You can get a right lick on here. It's an end tires. Woo! Death-defying. If 
to Congo Pass, go around. I've got no bell, I need to get a bell. Right. Might get some shit here. Because uh, there's a lot of people here. On the other side there is anyway. Switch backs of terror. <laughs> Still a bit nervous. <laughs> Careful on the corners. Right. Tricky this. You know, hand got sticking out into the rail. And then there's a, you lose a bit of momentum for the big hill. Too bad though. Oh, bunny hops. Somebody, woman complaining. She says, I don't think bikes were allowed on this path. You know, pet, there's a lockdown. Nothing's allowed, but we're all doing it. So if you're watching this, don't worry about it. I saw you, there was no danger. All you had to do was just ease off to the side. That was a bit tricky. Good. Good, but not that good. Absolutely petrified, I can see you now. <laughs> I'm not blind. And here we are, into the sea. Seems to be a gathering. Oh, 
He's just acting. I think the film in Vera Pit. Good as my films. Same two Land Rovers, Secrets of the Trade. Two Land Rovers with the same registration plate. Pet, my eye, how are you? Let's go down the tune. Oh. Oh, a bit of a cliff top. Lovely here, isn't it? God, oh, hold on. Went high. Used to say there's no bikes along here. I'm just waiting for people to complain because they've took the sound down. Because bikes can't come along here now. They changed it. Oh, I haven't fixed the path though. Yes. Ooh, I make these steps here. Steps, pa! Not laugh in the face of steps. And onto the causeway. The lighthouse. St. Mary's windmill. Tide's just gone out. Thank you. 
came came here in the summer. And sat here had a kind of northern monk. Just sitting here. Wasn't it? Alright. I'm gonna head back in. Back in. <laughs> every time and then head along that path that's it good little test let us know what you think of the point of view chest camera better than the handlebar mount i think it is Ooh. you get better idea Better perspective. I'll get quicker. It's just uh, been a long time since the road trail style. And that wind, the wind's a killer. It's too windy. It's blowing us to a dead stop. Right, I'm back. Anyway, it's not too mucky, a little bit of mud here and there. But what I did was, I invested in a, a Huaz pipe, so I can wash it off. Just bought the brass fitting. That was seven quid, the hose. I already had that. I think that was more expensive than the hose. That was three quid, wasn't it? So I'll give it a wash down. But that's it. So let's see how this turns out. Turns into some more of these like trail riding. I like. I'm just getting me. Um, I'm just getting me balance back and me nerve back a bit. After it's been a long layoff since I've done any trails, so I don't want to go on crazy trails and kill myself. You know. Right. Later.